In this video, I am going to show you how to share your phone's mobile internet with your router. You can share mobile internet with your router via wireless and wired methods. I'll cover both in this video. First, let's start with the Ethernet tethering method. For this, you'll require a Type-C to Ethernet adapter and an Ethernet cable. Plug the Ethernet adapter into your mobile device's USB Type-C port. Then, attach one end of the Ethernet cable to the adapter. Plug the other end of the Ethernet cable into the WAN port of your router. Ensure your router is powered on and fully operational. Open the settings app on your mobile device. Go to Connections, Mobile Hotspot and Tethering and enable Ethernet Tethering from here. In most cases, your router should automatically detect the tethered connection and configure itself and you should see your router's internet slide turns from orange to green. If not, access your router's admin panel. Look for the internet or WAN settings and ensure it is set to dynamic IP mode. Save the settings. Now all the devices connected to your router's Wi-Fi network should have the internet access. Let's look at the Wi-Fi repeater method. This method is useful if your router supports Wi-Fi repeating. Let's see how to do it. Go to settings on your mobile device. Navigate to connections. Select mobile hotspot and tethering. Tap on mobile hotspot. Toggle the switch on. You can customize the network name or SSID and password. If your router doesn't support the 5 GHz band, change the hotspot to 2.4 GHz and save it. After that, access your router's admin panel. Navigate to Quick Setup. Select the option to set up as a repeater or extender. Scan for available networks. Select your mobile hotspot and click Connect. Enter the hotspot password. You can customize the extended network name. Click Next. Note down the Wi-Fi network name and password from here. After setting this up, your router should connect to the mobile hotspot and extend the internet to all the connected devices. Now, connect your device to the extended network. Then you can verify the connection to ensure everything is working smoothly. There you have it. Two simple ways to use your phone and save the day when your ISP connection is down. If you found this video helpful, smash that like button and subscribe for more tech tips and tricks.